this is so little piracy made by Ted and myself. I hope you're in for a very blue time. And I don't actually know where everything is in this because I don't... I can't open the hack in any editor I have. Thanks, Ted. This one is great card. So, this is clearly the winner. It's also very blue. Uh, so, story, so little piracy. After a disastrous trip into the weapon-filled animal depot and an asteroid belt, Samus decided she needed to get off the main story and do a side quest. Unfortunately for Samus, her rent was due, and taking down animal weapons facilities doesn't pay well. So on her way back for some R&R, &R, she decides to head to Planet France to hunt for some treasure. Reading up on the lore of France, Samus finds out that port and plunder are abounding. So, such good English. However, the space pirates have made an outpost to mine some money out of the deep blue nothing. And to top it off, stories of a spooky, scary ghost of Bluebeard the dreaded rage monger lead Samus to believe the worst. The shack tools have arrived as well. Will Samus be able to pay the rent this month? Will the shack tools arrive and get the money? Will the color blue ever not be burned into your mind after experiencing the most epic contest entry ever made? Find out with so little piracy. Also, yes, card, there is such a spooky, scary ghost, but there is absolute greatness that will await you before then. <laughs> That's why I love this part. Pirates hate her! This bounty hunter discovered the secret to getting rich quick! Play our short rock pack to find out how. <laughs> oh boy. So yeah, so little piracy. Um So, okay, this the entire reason this room exists and doesn't count toward the room total because it's a save room is because we had the players loading into the room below but that caused all kinds of graphical issues for some reason, so we just added the save room. That works, I guess. So yeah, this is the uh, Bluebeard Fountain of Doom. So basically, we kind of split it off with uh, someone built on that side, someone built on this side. That's kind of what we did. Also ignore the doors, like that. Walks over here, so you with me. And there's just barriers as well, so who knows? Um, the right side, I'm not actually sure who made the music for that. Mental Gin actually made the music for this side. Also, look at this amazing room. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that room took me the longest to make. Card, you need to play the room. You need to experience it. First hand. So yeah, basically, I uh, decided wacky transparencies needed used. So that, that spikes. Okay. That is a lot of damage. <laughs> Also, that right there. Should pay attention to that. Oh, okay, so also, the doors show up through the transitions because of the pallet line they're on. There's a pallet line that doesn't actually fade out, so that's what's causing that. Yeah, look at, look at the transparencies, you know? People really don't use them enough. Look at all this amazing effects you have. My eyes! It's so beautiful, Jiffy. My eyes. Are your eyes it's feeling it's so blue yet? Weird. I can feel my eyes melting out. Oh, <laughs> Come back. <laughs> Look at it, though. It's so good. Oh, yeah. Ted is weak and added item dots literally everywhere. There were items when... Weren't supposed to be item dots, but even 
special item dots because he's bad. So yes, you get uh, doubloons. That is the money of France. Oh, and also because I hate you, there's an item in here. Um. Also, this room is great. This is Nagilum. That's a Star Trek reference if you don't get it. You just need to watch Star Trek. It's a Next Generation episode. This this room is one one of my early masterpieces. Is that a face in the background? Yes, that's in the gilum. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a pumpkin. It's not a pumpkin. That's in the gilum. It's a pumpkin. Don't insult the gilum. If you were wearing it's a red pumpkin. shirt, he'd make your head explode. I have not played Slow Paris since my first year in Berlin. How generous I was with those grapple blocks. Yeah, you gave him twos in the wall. Yeah, but, um, that's a very suspicious line of, uh, who, who would ever do something like that? Plus, there's an enemy Ooh. down here. Just don't touch that last block, that's a real spike. But there's just more doubloons in here. Also, you need to come down here to hit that switch. <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's fine. It's legal in 28 states. But, yeah, grappling is dumb. Just bomb you. <laughs> grappling is amazing, though. Just don't be bad at it. for his own hack. The, the whole hack is designed for the deep blue contest. This is supposed to make you feel the deepest blue you can ever feel. The deepest blue you can ever blue. Your mind will be blue. So, so this hack's designed to be bad? <laughs> it's the best hack. Put all kinds of easy grapple in. Items, shortcuts. Look at that, even say hi. Look at that, how nice. <laughs> <laughs> Never seen that before. And then this room probably took me like an hour and a half to build. <laughs> because reasons. <laughs> yes. Also, there's a hint for getting back. If people paid attention and noticed this weird contraption thing in the background. Hmm. Hmm. Why does it go straight through the spikes? I wonder why. But everyone's bad. It doesn't it was, it's the ceiling of the other room. Yeah, yeah see? Like, and nobody figures it out. They're like, oh, we have to go all the way around. Also, respin is in for one very important reason, but it's for the greatest room that ever existed. started out making this for one song, and I landed right on that dude. I started out making it for just one song in mind. Then I took some things from Fear. There's three of them in here. And we kind of sort of built around that. Thing in it. 
See all these lovely bugs. Look at these bugs. They're flashing a little different. Around the lamp, is it? Hmm? Is it around the lamp or what? No, they're actually an entirely different enemy. Ah. Uh. Let's see if I can do this without screwing this up. The answer is no, I can't. So, guess what we get to do again? to this. Yes. I will give one pokey point to anyone who can name the song. So what are the coins for? Or the the doubloons? <laughs> the doubloons are for your Indian percentage. For same as his rent. It's for buying ice creams. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's literally just so Samus can pay rent. <laughs> That's all. Bounty so where's so where's the space price? Well. She has to pay to like give the coins. Yeah, ignore that. Nice Alex. <laughs> oh my god. I'm grappling like Jiffy now. What do you mean grappling like Jiffy? I'm quite good at grappling, thank you. Are you though? <laughs> yes, I am. I've seen you play this game. I have not played this in this hand. Exactly, so how do you know you're good at grappling? I'm good at grappling in other hands. And then physics are the same. Do you know when you change? Yes, card, it does. Well, you know, I was feeling generous. I am feeling generous. <laughs> generous enough to give me some more teeth. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing can do that. <laughs> Not even rent. <laughs> rent doesn't give you teeth. I'm paying rent and I'm only left over. Alright. So, so far, now. the only grappling I've ever done is uh, in Prime and Samus Returns. individual or individual submitted this hack? This was myself and Ted. Oh, neat. <laughs> it has grapple. Of course I made it. No one else uses this thing. <laughs> Alright. Back to this room. This isn't even the hard part yet. <laughs> That's the best part of this. What a bag. 
Okay, so, after all that... It's not hard to uh, miss this platform and have to restart everything. And then this. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, if you fall down there, you have to restart everything. It's great. Well then, what piece of garbage has my pad brought on this cursor now? Why? But now you're safe. Just don't Fix be bad. Fake spikes? Shame. I mean, there's a hit in the background. One of the fear things is in here, except I made improvements. Say hi to Crocomire, or in this case, Turd Walker. Oh this is God. literally the best Crocomire ever made. Didn't quite get, turn out exactly how I wanted. I wanted something even better, but Crocomire's AI is dumb. Why isn't he blue? He's a turd. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Not everything can be blue. So, this looks pretty normal and everything. But, um, hey, there's super blocks back there. Not gonna get very far. So, the idea was to shoot supers and use reflex to go down, and under, and around him. It doesn't quite work because his AI. So, instead. Just put super blocks and use copy blocks to uh, move them around. I would. As you can see, it's a couple of super blocks down there. And now all the super blocks are gone. So, yeah, you were originally supposed to wrap the supers around him, but his hitbox goes basically infinity up and down. So you couldn't wrap a super under him because it would technically hit him and disappear. Also, blue. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Rather ingenious. So yeah, I just show you. There's six super blocks. Maybe you should find the super blocks. And these lamps kind of mark where the blocks are. There's one up there, and there was one right there. There's one down there. There's another up there. Stuff like that. But this is not just any Crocomire, this was Fear Crocomire. And I'm really hoping this kills someone. It's Crocomire's revenge! <laughs> but then he dies. Oh my god. Well then. I know there's graphics, I'm just gone anyone. <laughs> Ignore that. I'm really hoping that kills someone. That That's my one wish in life. Oh, well, perhaps they'll get lucky. Glory room. 
And then red! <laughs> Some ice creams. So, how many entries have you played through so far? This is the last one. Ah, uh, okay. And I. Also, the music is bad. Also, a skull boot. So, that is, uh. basically it for my side. We don't get to the most spectacular room for a little bit. I have to go through Ted Garbage first. Which is a lot easier if you do my side first. Because you get supers. And I have no idea what this music is. Get my high jump loops. Black Falcon knows what it's from. Almost sounds similar to the uh, um, the Aqua area in Fusion. No. That's kind of what I thought at first, but it definitely isn't that. <laughs> Well, I take that two bosses from now. Halo 3. This is a Halo play? Interesting. To be fair, out of all the hangs we've done for contests, this is probably in line with SL. With what? SLG. What do you mean? It, it's not as bad as um the Metroid So Little Dread does it. But it, it's not as good as So Little Garden. It's somewhere in the, in the middle. Not that I need such a thing. Just in case. Oh, oh, right. Someone, someone remind me when I get uh, a thing to do with it. Wow, ball. Good job. So, this is a thing. Ted likes putting in heated rooms. It's, it's like his uh, favorite pastime. Maybe you should name his hacks after hot chilies, like hard names. Floor for some reason. <laughs> That's interesting. No, not phase on. This is France. Ooh. 
oui, oui, ho, ho, ho. Yes. 50 doubloons. Exactly. 75 energy. 64 missiles. 15 blue missiles. They got like that. I'll, I'll, I'm with you. I was mixing a friend from Spanish uh, for some reason. I just feel resident French. <laughs> I try my best. That's super super nice. How many items are actually in this hand? How many what? Items. I don't know. Really? <laughs> I know how many are in my area. Or at least I know where they are. I didn't count them. Some things you don't know, you know. <laughs> so this is the uh, pirate po power bomb tree, though, which it took almost everyone never figured out that this was a pirate. Oh my God. <laughs> look, at the, look at the bandana and his super uber. He's got a sick haircut. That's not a haircut. It looks like a haircut. Okay, now it's, it looks like a, it looks like a, a bandana from one. He's got or, trousers. Yeah. He's got a bandana. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see it. And if you don't have supers, he's actually a lot harder. He needs an eye patch. He needs an eye patch. If he's only got one eye, which show on both of his eyes if we gave him an eye patch. Hey, you get a blues key. Blue's key. Yes, now you can play in the key of B. B. It's a music thing. I know. I used to play piano when I was younger. So now that we've done that, <laughs> hey, don't don't mock how pirates wear their bandanas. hard sometimes to tell what is foreground and what is not in this. I blame Ted. Ouch. Hey, look at all these doubloons. We're going to be able to buy lunch, too. As long as it's supposed to make you feel blue. Hmm. You know, we've gone a whole contest about blue, and that song has not made it in. Yeah, that is quite surprising. <laughs> That's like the one thing you would think that would have got into everyone. All the injuries. <laughs> I was gonna say, I wonder how much a doubloon is actually worth. That's 50 coins. Wait, no, because 
in the item it gives you 50 doubloon. So that would mean one doubloon is equal to one. So this <laughs> he'll never actually guess who made this. <laughs> <laughs> what, was it Ted by any chance? That's a slope just, elevator. <laughs> just a wild <laughs> What the hell is that? It's a slope elevator. Is that an elevator room? It's a refill room. Oh, so it doesn't elevator. count. <laughs> we're, 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 we're ignoring that thing for now. We'll come back to it. So, okay. Also, the fun fact, I did not put any Rinkas on this hack. Ted is the sole one responsible for Rinkas being in here. I kind of doubt that. Also, this is the other fear thing. Spose bow. Two out of three. So... Uh, Fierce Space Bow. Doesn't... Didn't have Rinkas. But... Does something else. He, he's, uh... Kind of... Not opening. At all. Mm. Mm. Also, I love how Space Bow's body... Hides the Rinkas behind it. Pretty great. So it, it, it goes behind the tiles, but it goes in front of the rinkers. Yeah. But the rinkers go in front of the tiles. Yeah, don't worry about it. So yeah, the thing with this is, Spose Pro doesn't really do anything until you destroy his little Spose Pro pods. Just minding his business. He's got little supposed to be spore pods hanging around. And there's a fifth one hanging out up here. And then once those are destroyed, he's like, oh, I'm gonna open up and bark at you! <laughs> that was actual supposed to be barking. <laughs> But, when he opens up, he also shoots out little, uh, they're really hard to see because they're black in this, but he shoots out little spores from his core. I think you, you shoot yourself in a stream at one point. Because I actually remember this. It's very possible. And so, uh, Rinkos don't stop spawning when Spose Spore dies. That almost killed someone that I saw. I was very disappointed it didn't happen. So that was, uh, Fear Thing number two. That gets you a Cobalt suit. Now we can go into, like, heated rooms, because we have the color blue on our side. So you went from light blue to dark blue? Yes. But now we're basically blue Batman, so it's fine. Okay. So if it's meant to be a heated room and there's no like heat, then what is blue? Some corrosive thing. Oh, oh, oh. Also, uh, prepare yourself. If you lay a power bomb in one of these heated rooms, stuff happens. Oh, girl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> it's so amazing. Wow. <laughs> Not exactly sure what's going on there, but, uh... <laughs> Pretty great. Heat effect. In 
come back home. It's pretty great. So before I go check out my refill room, which Ted made, by the way, did not make there. <laughs> We're gonna go to this other hidden room, get what's in there. The the fun fact about that uh heated room though? Or not the heated room, that refill room. That whole grappling bit I did earlier is can be completely skipped. All you have to do is uh go to Crocky and get ice. And you can skip that whole section. So the grappling not required at all. But anyone who says that it's I want it to be bad. nice, yes. That they are bad. So you can either get good or just be bad? Yes. Going back for a second to the uh, to the slope elevator room, why uh, was that made by Ted Zero or was that made by you? Because that was there made was... by Ted. Okay, well, he, Ted then wanted he put, to make uh, some. Uh, Ted didn't like the room, so he wanted to make something so bad that no one would suspect he's the one who made it. Is that why he has the M Is that why he had MST <laughs> twice in the background? Yes. He's like, no one will suspect me of this. Oh, so it was Ted. Yes, that was Ted. <laughs> <laughs> like, I could ever make something that bad. I make nothing but works of art, as you will see shortly. Of course. The, the most spectacular room is going to be coming up here soon. We'll save. There, there's so much um, about this. It's just great. <laughs> Is MST a che cheater? Yes. Good answer. Two of our uh, lose keys. Got two more, and they're really close together. Um. Okay. So no, unfortunately, no Caesar flashes. Thanks, Sidehopper. Sidehopper, you want to death. Okay. No, no Caesar flashes, unfortunately. What's the point in playing that? made me mad with your stupid room things. So I, <laughs> I, in response, made the greatest thing ever made. Oh we'll just, boy. We'll just get through the uh, amazing refill room here. <laughs> and <laughs> I love this room. You can tell it's really high effort. the screen but I say hack Metroid. You can tell it's high effort because all the uh, enemies that were definitely carefully placed in their positions on purpose. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, there's the, there's, there it is. The last one. That was the last one I wanna... Okay. So you would either need to fall down there and get wave beam, and then go all the way back around to avoid the grapple, or you could do the grapple part, and then you just need to go around and do this once, because you need wave beam for this game. And this room... Okay, Card Weaver, if you're listening to this in the background, this next room is the greatest thing I have ever made. I think I haven't made much that. Much that's good. <laughs> oh my god. And Ted made sure to put the Mother Brain music in for this. 
<laughs> and there's Shaq Duel just hanging around. <laughs> Hey, MST for this. So, yeah, welcome to. This. Wow. If you fail, you get resent back into Shack Tools waiting gear. Okay. This hack feels like less like a collaboration and more like a an ongoing battle between you and Ted. <laughs> this. This is the room is the reason why I told Ted to put respin in for, for scrubs. Because otherwise you have to do the bounces up, you'd have to do the bounce up, plus IBJ from a couple of them. Wow. <laughs> Bomb jump across that. <laughs> Good God. And if you fail at any point, you get sent back. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is what some SLCs, no, SLC, SL, so. SLIs, grapple escape. So yeah, you see, there's there's more bomb jumping and stuff here. <laughs> so yeah, you, your falling speed can be too fast to actually get picked up. Or get in the morph tunnel sometimes. Oops. Uh, ignore that arrow for now, Dave. Don't worry about it. It's fine. <laughs> this this first one's kind of hard to get a respin off of. <laughs> well, I did it, and then I failed it. Failing at your own design. <laughs> this is the greatest room I have ever made. So, yeah, I mean, you can bomb jump across all that, but that's silly. So I, I made a shortcut. All I get you is the boots. Also, there's a hidden off screen thing here. Wow. <laughs> so. <laughs> so, that's for the doubloon. There is uh, one of our required blues keys in here, which is even more spectacular. This is, this is the greatest thing I have ever come up with. This contraption is... <laughs> I am sorry I missed that. So yeah, um, look at this arrow pointing to the spike of speed booster thing. And the smiley face. And speed booster. Speed booster. <laughs> hmm. So I'm trying to train people. The spike. It's a very real spike that gets rid of it. Hmm. I'm trying to train people. Oh, that's obvious. Speed booster. Oh, that's a spike. But wait. If you destroy the block, the spike goes away. So let's. <laughs> that worked really well. Good, good short charge. Let's jump into it! Oh, dang it! I got hit by the spike! What? Failed. The idea is, you jump up, with the whole ceiling is speed boost blocks, and you just hit another door transition, which takes you right back here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> because I hate you! <laughs> <laughs> Don't do stupid, dumb, room, <laughs> arbitrary requirements! <laughs> Let me guess, there's a reef at the end. No, that, there's a required... There's a required thing. Also, the uh, whole ceiling is that way, so if you tried to jump oh up through God. here... 
because you didn't test that out to see that spikes, you would jump through the ceiling and hit the door transition as well. I... So the idea is to do that. And now that's air, and then you get this wonderful <laughs> blue garbage. And there's the last blues key. B. Well then. <laughs> this is my, the greatest room ever made. <laughs> it's so beautiful. Look at this beacon chat. I like that Ted put in the mother brain music. That was not my doing. But now we can fall down and just go into this room. We have all the things. Planet France. Now that we've got all the blue things, we we gain access to Bluebeard. Anyone want to uh, hazard a guess as to what Bluebeard is? Probably Bradley or something. I swear, every single hack has used the uh, the new Samus graphics. <laughs> so the last, by Nova, the last sphere thing is a uh, phantom. Shit, go that door up there. You can't actually. Who is wearing a? Uh... Who has a beard? <laughs> and a spooky eye. Oh my god. And because it's Fear Phantom, it's a pain to hit. And when you do hit him, no matter what you hit him with, he just gets mad. <laughs> oh my god. This, this one's oh a boy. little bit tamer than the Fear one in terms of the damage it gives, but... Call that tame? In terms of the damage, it's not dealing four tanks. Uh, so yeah, no matter no matter what attack you use, missiles, charge, whatever, you shoot it. He goes into enrage mode. So you might as well just use your most powerful weapon. Might as well. He also appears and disappears awfully quickly when he goes into that phase. <laughs> yeah, 
Well, you know, I need to make some bosses challenging. Not even be able to uh, hit him when you fire from across the room. You, you, you have to take some damage to hit him. Which I think is why Ted did things. Oh, we did alter the AI. Look at this. Yeah. But there goes Bluebeard. Bluebeard the blind? Bluebeard the double dead. Bluebeard the blue. Oh. Hey, you you blew up Bluebeard. You're you're done. <laughs> <laughs> and then France blows up. France the planet. Oh. Well then. <laughs> Why? Does <laughs> France surrender? Don't blow up. <laughs> and then that song everyone wanted starts playing. Oh, it's the blue song. <laughs> this is the very first thing we did for the hack was make the song. <laughs> thing we did was this song. It does like there's fear bosses I'm not using currently. Let's put those in. Hello. <laughs> and then it just kind of awkwardly <laughs> resets. <laughs> This is fine. Ten out of ten for style. But <laughs> you're such a cock. This <laughs> <Wasn't> that part. <laughs> I'm like, there's no way I'm gonna be able to stream this. I want to stream your hacks, but I'm gonna fail it. I'm gonna be there for. Well, blame Jiffy for that room. He, he made me mad when I made that <laughs> room. Jiffy! It's somewhat my fault, isn't it? It is! If you didn't make me <laughs> mad, I would not have made that room. If your hack wasn't so garbage last time, I wouldn't have made that room. <laughs> and there were oh, like, as well. I saw that, and it just... <laughs> oh. You're such, you're such a cock, as MSD! <laughs> Yeah, thanks, MSD. <laughs> no, but I saw that. Were arbitrary room requirements worth this? <laughs> no, I, it was a go it's an amazing, but you have to be that skillful. I, if I get, if you gave this hack to a snake, he would be an amateur. <laughs> but it would have been hilarious. I know, but that's why I'm saying, send it to him. He doesn't know what he's gonna, what he's gonna do. No one's gonna tell him. <laughs> Uh, no blue Samus at the end? No. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, the original idea was to replace her graphics with one of those aliens from the video. But that didn't happen. 
<laughs> also, your rate for collecting items is just the amount of doubloons. That is not all of the doubloons, I know for a fact. That's quite cool. But I don't know exactly how many, how many there are. 